Thanks for Maphrodite's born without genitals. Tricks up our sleeves, huh? Insane. Just a nightclub singer with a broken heart. I still love you. Hold on to yourself. You're in over your head and you're up there. you doing? Nothing. Really? Because I keep hearing a mad for that this, a cop that. Go away. What? You know, go watch your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you. What the fuck? You disrespectful little asshole. I can't believe you did that. That's my TV. You don't talk to me like that. I can't believe you. Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole. Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides, just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want, to be hit by your son? Yeah. No. I just want you to do something. Besides, sit there, eating. Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah. Well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Hey, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Bike ride, then. Bike ride. You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. Bike ride along Vespucci Beach. Okay, Dad, I got just the thing to show you. This day was going so well until you showed up. You know that? Oh! You know, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. How Jimmy. am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so... Unbelievably fuck-based. If I'm hanging with you, and listening to my music. Oh, hell yeah. Don't push me. Seriously. Some guys borrow your boat. Driver's choice. Old man despot. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnap. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right. They fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. But I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm going to let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... What? <sighs> I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us if you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years, but that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Yeah, well, I had to. To protect you. Yeah, keep telling yourself that when you see their faces every time you close your eyes. Here we are, the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. What? Hey, you! Two bikes. Take your pick. Yo, thanks. If I beat you to the end of the pier, you're buying me a new TV. Into the pier? All right. But if I beat you, you're going to behave like a human being.
like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! Look, if you do go... Take me out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Our house? Yeah. Man, you got a killer fad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Those walls to talk. You think I do it? Hey. No. Hey. Shit, hey, Daddy. cool, man. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Oh, oh, hey. Oh, oh, man. Come. I like that. What's the problem? You're such a jerk. Come on. Dad, you dumbass, these guys are serious! Yeah, well, so am I! Go up to the seat of my fucking boat! Oh, motherfuckers! Get on! Now! I'm about to skin you alive! God damn it! Go! Taking you back to your brother. I'm an accessory to murder. No, you're not. You're an accessory to self-defense. Have I like got to be a witness because I I like did some blow. You did blow? Yeah, I did some blow, and that might like make my testimony inadmissible. You're not admitting anything. There won't be a trial unless you're on a trial for doing blow. After you ruined my day, stole my friendship, cat. Started it, and we wouldn't be in this mess if you hadn't hung out with some creepy ass porno people at Dunblow. Oh, uh, you didn't know I did blow. 
Once I told you I did blow, so this should be like an increase in trust and honesty thing. And porno dudes are like the best dudes I could be with. Porno dudes? Really? Yeah, they actually respect women and treat us right. It's Los Santos, Dad. What do you expect when he moved here? Enough! This conversation is over! Keep hiding your head in the clouds. The 50s are over. Even the 80s are over. See? That's the problem. Because they're not over in my head. Well, grow up! I see that traitor! Jimmy! Jimmy! You! You fucking asshole! Yeah, he, he's the fucking asshole, okay? He smashed my TV, and he took me to the beach. The beach, with my skin. So what, you send him out to spoil my day, too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like he gets sometimes, and he just went. I'm getting a cab. I'm coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life. 